So coach, how are you feeling uh, physically, mentally after a really long trip out to Doha to uh, see some great Gamecock action? Uh, excited, uh, very fatigued. Uh, my head is a little bit underwater from the time difference, but um, excitement is the main thing that uh, we come home to, to bring back a gold medal and uh, two athletes that are fourth and 12th in the world. Uh, it was just an incredible feeling uh, over the years, uh, the, the, the time that it's taken to get to, for us to get to this place. Uh, so it's just a, a really uh, an exciting time for us. What's, up? Sorry, go ahead. What's it like to see one of your, your athletes come back with a gold medal? It's awesome, man. It is great. Um, I think it's a testament to our program and uh, all that goes on here and the hard work that's put in by our staff. And it's definitely a team effort with what we do here. And uh, the resources and the things that are in place for a student athlete is just incredible, incredible support system. But it is it's absolutely awesome when you are in the place that uh, your, your, your work gets displayed. And um, I feel like what we do here in Gamecock Nation is, is showing um, the support that's given to our program, uh, as it is to all the athletic teams here, uh, that if you want to come and be the best, uh, that there's a support system in place for it to happen. So um, just it's a, just a great time. Uh, it was a great feeling. It's great to be on the staff, but it's even better to come home with some gold. So What makes Waddle so special? Ooh, a lot of things. Um, she uh, displays uh, a, a great worth ethic that uh, a lot of our formal um, greats have had. Uh, she's special because she has a special talent. Um, I've never seen her without being humble uh, about her talent and her gift. Uh, she works very hard. She works hard at what she does. Um, some sort of way, um, she has been able to kind of skip grades, if you will, in uh, this process because of her talent. But she also has um, some uniqueness to uh, where she's at mentally for her age, in my opinion. Um, she's able to uh, compartmentalize some of the stresses that come with this level um, without anyone uh, saying anything to her about it. And, and maybe some of that comes from her background and uh, family, but she's able to set aside the things that she know is gonna be a stress to her and expect for it to happen. And then the stresses that she has no control over, she just let those happen. So the things that she control, she has a good handle on that. She's very, very focused. Um, I've been on several teams and she did not let uh, the stage intimidate her. Um, and so she's, she's very special. For somebody your age, um, people don't generally, are, they're not able to do that. She, she, she did that and every conversation I had with her, she, she was very focused, so uh, unique. Um, but she's, she's a great person. Um, every race is special to her. Uh, she's nothing she takes for granted. And uh, I think sometimes all of us can get in that place of taking things for granted, and I never see her that way. She's, she's special on so many fronts. And I know she was running for a rival country, but talk about Aaliyah's journey. Um, it feels like she's put in a lot of time here to really train at South Carolina and to see that pay off on the world stage with her finishing 12th. Uh, what does that say about her character and her preparation? Uh, yes, uh, it says a lot about Aaliyah because uh, you know she's been uh, to the world championships before, and uh, this time, um, she proved it to be a little different for her um, and everything is a process and she continues to embrace her process for what it takes for her to be her best and um, sometimes it takes people a little longer as I said Wadlin has skipped some grades here um, Aaliyah is uh, staying true to what it takes for her to be great and uh, this this world championships for Aaliyah was um, much better for her and her efforts to end up 12th in the world is just phenomenal and I, I just feel certain that um, in this next year to come with the Olympic year and as long as she decides to stay in the sport you can continue to look for her to do great things as well.